But let's go ahead and start with uh, one of our written questions. So Guy, this question came in from Dean yesterday and he asks, how can I defeat my inclination to drink alcohol? The reason that I turn to alcohol or drugs or my workaholic brain, all the balls I have to keep suspended in midair, why do I turn to that in the first place? I'm trying to overcome something. I drink or smoke because I'm in this sick world. I can't wait to create a drug to sell to you. I have social anxiety disorder. You know what social anxiety disorder is? It's when you don't know better than to identify with an anxious thought or feeling. You can't treat it with a drug. You can only numb the brain so that it stops duplicating its actions. So how can I, wanting to overcome alcohol produce the end of my alcoholism when my alcoholism begins with wanting to overcome my fear of inadequacy or whatever it may be. The task is not to overcome anything. It's a failed effort. Christ said, resist not evil. Translation in the original language, do not oppose what opposes you. But you're not saying, guy, that I should just drink Absolutely not. But I'm saying be more interested in the consciousness that feels it must drink than in blaming yourself and judging yourself for what you have no understanding of at all right now. Begin with understanding, not looking for power. Ignorance looks for power. Ignorance looks for power. Understanding is power. But see, that takes work, and I can't hate myself, and I love hating myself. No, I don't. Yes, you do. How do I know? Because you keep doing it. I never go and ask for cilantro on my burrito. Why don't I ask for cilantro? Because I had my mouth washed out a lot of times when I was growing up, and cilantro tastes just like soap to me. So if I have cilantro every day, it must mean what? Something in me likes cilantro. You can't cut it any other way. If it's that obvious, there it is.